We must use it to promote a desirable marriage. In the meantime, let me describe to you the type of woman. I mean the physical type he should be encouraged to fall in love with. Now, this question has been answered for us by spirits far deeper down the lower archy than you and I. Oh, it is the business of these great masters to produce in every age a misdirection in what may be called sexual taste. This they do by working through the small circle of popular artists, designers, and actresses who determine the fashionable type. The aim is to guide your patient away from those with whom spiritually healthy, happy, and fertile marriages are most likely. At one time, we directed the male taste to the statuesque, aristocratic beauty. <laughs> Mixing men's vanity with their desires. At another, we selected an exaggeratedly feminine type. Fate, languishing. so that folly, cowardice, and general falseness were at premium. At present, we're on the opposite tact. We now teach men to like women whose bodies are scarcely distinguishable from those of boys. This type of beauty is more transitory than most, aggravating the female's chronic horror of growing old with many excellent results. We have also engineered a great increase in the exhibition of the nude. Oh, it is all fake, of course. The figures are falsely drawn, made to appear firmer and more slender than a full-grown woman has a right to be. 